Your Health System Insight is a private web-based analytical tool developed by the Canadian Institute for Health Information, or CAIHI. Insight is designed to help health system managers and analysts measure, monitor, and improve the performance of healthcare organizations. To maintain data privacy, CAIHI only provides access to this tool to authorized clients who work in hospitals, health regions, ministries, or departments of health. We thought the best way to give you a taste of the powerful functionality and content available in Insight is with a story. So meet Marie, a fictional decision support analyst with the Central Health Region. Marie uses your health system insight to better understand how the hospitals in the central health region are performing by looking at their indicator results. This information will help Marie's region with planning, quality improvements, health system management, and more. Starting at the Insight launch page, the Summary Results dashboard, Marie gets an overview of her region's performance on key indicators. The color coding and symbols on this page let her quickly determine whether their performance is above average, average, or below average. She can also see the direction their performance is heading. So now she can easily identify areas she might want to explore further. Looking at their summary, Marie notices that the results for the Time and Emergency Department until Disposition Decision Indicator have improved. However, the results for the Emergency Department Wait Time for Physician Initial Assessment Indicator are still below average. So while their hard work in reducing emergency department wait times is starting to bear fruit, there's still room for improvement. Marie also notices that they're doing quite well on many other indicators, but need to keep an eye on the weakening trend for their 30-day medical readmission indicator results. Armed with this high-level information, Marie decides to take a closer look at the trends for their emergency department wait times and compare her region's results to others. Going from one dashboard to another in Insight is quick and simple. Marie just clicks on the hyperlinks at the top of the screen. In the Trends and Comparisons dashboard, she compares her region's performance with two neighboring regions, as well as with the provincial and Canadian results. The information she finds here is quite useful. The trend line shows that their emergency department wait time for physician initial assessment has been improving, but it's still higher than the neighboring regions, their provinces and Canada's. Knowing how their peers are performing helps Marie set an achievable target for improvement. From the Hospital Groupings tab, she can view the emergency department wait times for all the facilities in her region. This helps her understand whether the longer waits are specific to a particular hospital or occurring across the region. As she reviews her region's facility level results, she notices that a few hospitals seem to have some challenges, so she decides to create a custom report to give her more detail. Insight's custom breakdown reports let her zero in on the specific data she's interested in. The report she creates will help her better understand and assess the factors that are contributing to her region's results. To create a custom report, Marie just follows the prompts to select the emergency department wait time for physician initial assessment indicator, the fiscal time she wants to look at, the hospitals from her region, the attributes she wants to use to break down their wait time results, and the 90th percentile metric. This custom report helps her see that the longer waits usually occur in the evening and night between 6 p.m. and 5.59 a.m. And they're most prevalent at Hospital J. The wait time at Hospital K is generally short except for the non-complex patient group at night time. This information helps her hone in on the real issues and identify where her region may need to focus some attention. Now that Marie has an idea about how and where her region might be able to improve their emergency department wait times, she wants to see if she can identify potential opportunities to reduce their medical readmission rate. For that, she uses the Indicator Exploration Dashboard. Looking at their 30-day medical readmission indicator results, she immediately spots the case mix groups, or CMGs, that have the highest readmission counts and the most responsible diagnoses for those readmitted cases. From the CMG bar graph, she notices that the highest counts of readmitted cases were for chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, or COPD, followed by heart failure. A couple of quick clicks in the fiscal year filter show that these two case mix groups also have the highest counts of readmissions from year to year. So Marie selects these particular CMGs on the bar graph to dig a little deeper. As she does this, the dashboard dynamically filters the results in the other charts and graphs using these groups. Here, she notices that the majority of these cases were readmitted with another COPD event, and those discharged home with support had a slightly higher crude rate for readmission than those discharged without support. 
This makes her wonder whether there might be opportunities to improve their coordination for discharges from hospital to community care, their post-discharge follow-up, and their patient education. Maybe patients aren't receiving the level of support they need. And maybe some patients don't have a primary care provider for post-discharge follow-up, resulting in them returning to hospital when their care needs could have been addressed in the community. As Marie works with staff in her health region to identify specific solutions to improve performance, she knows she'll be able to rely on the data and insight to monitor the impact of their initiatives. You've seen how Marie used insight to get a quick visual overview of her region's performance, compare their performance with others, identify above and below average performers in her region, determine some potential drivers for their indicator results, like the time of day for emergency department visits and most common health conditions for readmissions, and monitor their monthly results over time to evaluate the effectiveness of their performance improvement activities. This story gave you just a small glimpse of how healthcare systems across Canada can use your health system insight to measure and monitor health system performance. Insight is just one of many Kaihai products and services designed to help healthcare systems turn healthcare data into actionable information and improve healthcare and health system performance.